Hi, my name is Martha Luke. I write for Getting Through Tough Times with Healthy Place. In this video, I am going to be talking about how to cope with depression when it seems like an endless winter. I'm from the Chicagoland area, and if you know anything about Chicago, you know that winters are completely unpredictable. Um, this year has been pretty brutal. Around in November, we had our first snowstorm, which was totally random. And then after that, it was pretty mild up until the new year. And after the new year, it was awful. Freezing cold, so, uh, negative temperatures, snowstorms. Um, and I, it just, for me, it just took a toll on my depression. I, I didn't want to leave my house. I, I got angry actually because, and I know that sounds kind of weird, but I got angry because it's like all I wanted to do was go for a walk. And I didn't want to do that in like 15 degree weather. Mm -mm. But um, now I'm trying to do a few things to uh, come out of that depression and um, and kind of find hope for spring. Now, the first thing I try to do is just get outside, um, especially if, say, it's like upper 20s, lower 30s, yet it's freezing. It sounds like it's freezing cold, and while, while it is, it, I, I still, I, if I just get myself to go outside for like five minutes, I can remind myself, you know what, it's not that bad I can it'll eventually warm up if I can go outside in this weather I'll be able to go outside again in, in this weather again um, so it just helps me to remember that I'm still I'm still able to function um, another thing that I try to do is reflect on past winters that have been brutal in 2011, when I went to Northern Illinois University in DeKalb, um, there were like three snow days and a huge snowstorm. And it, while it was like, while I hated the snow, uh, everybody had a huge snowball fight. And I, one of my friends convinced me to go join him. And so I did. And it was actually a lot of fun because the snowball fight gave me a chance to meet new people and bond with other people from campus. So it uh, wasn't really, it turned out to be pretty fun. Um, and uh, one more thing that I try to do is visualize the perfect spring. Um, I look back on some of the springs from the past that I've enjoyed and what I've enjoyed doing. And I think about what it would be like to be able to uh, enjoy that type of spring this year. It kind of gives me something to look forward to and one thing that helps to visualize spring is to do guided meditation or even just listen to nature sounds um, on YouTube videos. So if you guys have any other ideas on how to get through us, how to get through depression during a seemingly endless winter, Feel free to share in the comments. Thank you for watching this video. Bye.